Hello again, boys and girls. It's me. Now, I thought today I could tell you another musical story. Hmm. I wonder which one it is. Can you guess? It's the story of the three Billy Goats Gruff. Billy Goats are boy goats, and these three were all brothers. The first one, the littlest, was called Trippity Trip. Can you call out for Trippity Trip? Trippity Trip was the smallest. He didn't have any horns yet. Can you see? But he lived happily with his brothers. Here's the next Billy Goat. He's called Trottity Trot. Can you call out for Trottity Trot? Trottity Trot had horns, but they weren't very big yet. Shall we meet the biggest goat? Can you call out for Trampity Tramp? Trampity Tramp had big long horns and they were very sharp. The goats were very hungry. Do you know what goats like to eat? Yes, juicy green grass. The goats came marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching one by one, the little one stopped to suck his thumb. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. The goats came marching two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching two by two, the middle one stopped to do up his shoe. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. The goats came marching three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching three by three, the big one stopped to scratch his knee. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. They all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. The goats had found their field of fresh, juicy green grass, shall we say? Hooray! But there was one problem. Between them and the field of fresh, juicy green grass was a deep river. So the goat couldn't swim across to get to the grass. Hey, shall we sing the river song? Row, row, row your boat. Are you ready? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. If you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. The goats noticed something. They noticed in the distance. There was an old wooden bridge. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. But Little did the goats know that something terrible lived under the bridge. Deep, deep down beneath the wooden bridge, in the muddy river, this is where I live. I listen and I wait for people passing by, then gobble them all up before they get away. <laughs> deep, deep down beneath the wooden bridge in the muddy river. This is where I live. I listen and I wait 
for people passing by, then gobble them up before they get away. <laughs> Mr. Troll was hungry. I'm hungry. I know. I'll go and wait under the bridge for my favourite food. Do you know what Mr. Troll's favourite food was? I'll tell him it's goats. So Mr. Troll went to hide under the bridge, waiting for goats to eat. After a little while, the goats arrived at the bridge, but they were feeling very tired. So they knew that maybe they should have a sleep and wait until morning time. Then they could go across and eat the fresh juicy green grass. They fell fast asleep. Can you hear the wind? They dreamt all night long of fresh juicy green grass. Well, eventually it was morning time. Can you say cock a doodle doo? The first goat to wake up was the little one. Now, do you remember his name? Yes, Trippity Trip. Trippity Trip wanted to go straight across the bridge and as he ran across the bridge, he made such a noisy noise. Like this. Trippity Trip, Trippity Trip, over the rickety bridge. Can you say it? Trippity Trip, Trippity Trip, over the rickety bridge. And again, Trippity Trip, Trippity Trip, over the rickety bridge. In fact, he was so noisy, he woke up Mr. Troll, who jumped up onto the bridge, looked around and said, Who's that trippity tripping over my bridge? He looked this way and then this way. <gasps> oh, look, it's a little billy goat. <laughs> Just what I was waiting for. Should I gobble this one up right now? Oh dear, trippity trip was in trouble. What should he do? He decided to sing a little song to get himself out of trouble. I'm a billy goat gruff and a very billy tough. But please take note, there's a bigger billy goat coming up behind me, nice and juicy. Mr. Troll, please let me go. Well, Mr. Troll was very excited. Did you say there's a bigger goat coming up behind you? Yes, said Trippity Trip. Oh, well, maybe I'll better wait for the big goat. Go on, off you go. And Mr. Troll went back under the bridge and fell asleep. Trippity Trip ran as fast as he could, shouting, Thank you, Mr. Troll. Can you see me? Thank you, Mr. Troll. Can you see me now? I'm off to the field of fresh, juicy, green grass. Well, the next goat to wake up was the middle-sized goat. Do you remember his name? Yes, Trottity Trot. He jumped up onto the bridge and started to run across, but he was ever so noisy, boys and girls. As he ran across, he went trottity trot, trottity trot, over the rickety bridge. Trottity trot, trottity trot, over the rickety bridge. Trottity trot, trottity trot, over the rickety bridge. In fact, he was so noisy that very soon Mr. Troll woke up. He jumped up onto the bridge and he said, Who's that trottity trotting over my bridge? He looked around and suddenly, 
Oh, yes. It's a big old belly goat. Oh, oh, just what I was waiting for. Right, shall I gobble this one up for my breakfast? Oh dear. Trottity Trot is in trottity trouble. So do you know what he did? He sang a little song to try and get him out of trouble. I'm a billy goat, rough and a very billy tough But please take note, there's a bigger billy goat Coming up behind me, nice and juicy Mr Troll, please let me go Mr Troll was very excited Did you say there's a bigger goat coming up behind you? Yes, said Trottity Trot Oh, well, because I'm greedy, I think I'll wait for the big goat. So, Mr. Troll disappeared back under the bridge and Trottity Trot was free to go. He ran across the bridge as fast as he could. Oh, thank you, Mr. Troll. Can you see me? Thank you. I'm off to the field of fresh, juicy green grass. Can you see me now? into the field of juicy grass. Well, Mr. Troll was starting to feel really hungry. Oh dear, I'll keep letting these goats go and my tummy's rumbling. Oh no, I think I'll have a little healthy snack while I wait for the big goat. Boys and girls, yes, trolls do like to eat healthy snacks in between their big meals. Do you eat healthily? I'm sure you do. Um, can I find something for Mr. Troll to eat and you can tell me if it's healthy or not? Let's have a look. Oh, I've got a peach and some cheese. Hmm. Which one would you choose for your healthy snack, boys and girls? Yes, I think I would too. A peach would be great for Mr. Troll. I'll find something else as well. Oh look, boys and girls, I've got a nice crunchy pepper and oh, a big bar of chocolate. Hmm. Which one do you think Mr. Troll would prefer to eat? Remember, he likes to eat healthy snacks. Yes, I think he'd like that crunchy pepper too. Now. He's thirsty. I'll find something. I've got, oh, a bottle of fizzy pop and some water. Which one's the healthiest, boys and girls? Yes, the water. That hasn't got any sugar in, has it? I think Mr. Troll would like to drink the water. Choose a healthy snack. Choose a healthy snack, not cakes and biscuits, fizzy drinks, chocolate crisps, stop and think. Because they're full of sugar and fat, so choose a healthy snack. Hmm, what should we have, Mr. Troll? Oh, have you tried tomatoes? <laughs> or a glass of milk to drink? Oh, you could have some breadsticks. They're just enough to fill that gap Choose a healthy snack Choose a healthy snack Not cakes and biscuits, fizzy drinks Chocolate crisps, stop and think oh. Because they're full of sugar and fat So choose a healthy snack uh, What else could we have? Well... Have you tried a piece of fruit? Or juicy raisins in a pack. Oh. You could have a little sandwich. Mm. It's just enough to fill that gap. Choose a healthy snack. Choose a healthy snack. Not cakes and biscuits, fizzy drinks, chocolate crisps. Stop and think. Oh. Because they're full of sugar and fat. So choose a healthy snack. Because they're full of sugar and fat So, choose a healthy snack The 
there's one more goat, remember? He was called Trampity Tramp. Oh, I'm extra hungry. I've been waiting for my breakfast to go to the field of fresh, juicy green grass. Shall I go across the bridge? <gasps> he didn't know that Mr. Troll was waiting for the biggest goat. Off he went up onto the bridge, and as he went across, he made such a terrible noise. Trampity tramp, trampity tramp, over the rickety bridge. Can you say it? Trampity tramp. Trampity tramp over the rickety bridge. Trampity tramp, trampity tramp over the rickety bridge. He was so noisy that as he got to the middle of the bridge, he stopped for a breath of fresh air and suddenly Mr. Troll jumped up, looked around and said, Who's that trampity tramping over? My bridge! And when he looks... <gasps> oh! It's the biggest goat I've ever seen. Yippee! It's time to gobble this one up. Oh dear. Trampity Tramp is in Trampity Trouble. So, do you know what he did? I'm a billy goat gruff and I'm very billy tough. But please take note, there's a bigger billy goat. Coming up behind me, nice and juicy. Mr. Troll, please let me go. I'm a billy goat gruff and a very billy tough. But please take note, there's a bigger billy goat coming up behind me, nice and juicy. Mr. Troll, please let me go. Boys and girls. Is there another billy goat waiting to come across the bridge? Trampity Tramp tried to trick Mr. Troll. But Mr. Troll was very excited. Did you say there's an even bigger goat? Now where's this really big goat? I want to eat that one up. He looked over here and as he did so, Trampity Tramp ran at Mr. Troll as fast as he could. And with his big sharp horns, he poked him in the bottom. Boink! <gasps> Mr. Troll flew high into the air. <laughs> and landed with a splash in the river. Boys and girls. Mr. Troll was swept away. The river went into a bigger river, which went through the valleys and the towns, through the cities and out into the sea. Mr. Troll was swept away and no one ever saw him ever again. Should we say, hooray! I think it's time for a happy ending song, don't you? The goats came marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching one by one, the little one stopped to suck his thumb. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. The goats came marching two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching two by two, the middle one stopped to do up his shoe shoe. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. The goats came marching three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The goats came marching three by three, the big one stopped to scratch his knee. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. And they all came marching, looking for fresh green grass. And that was the end of my story.